Well, First Wednesday of the month, so we get to catch up with Mary Wilson of Sarah Harding. Mary, good to see you. Good morning. You got a summer special going on. I've heard the commercial. Yes, yes. We I came in and recorded the commercial, and I think it's. I haven't heard it yet. I'm never hitting just at the right time, you know. But uh, well, you sound great. Oh, wonderful. <laughs> Maybe I should start going on radio. There huh? you, there there you, you go. go. <laughs> yes, we do have a summer special. Uh, and now's the time to think about getting settled before winter because winter is coming quickly as we know even though it might be 80 or 90 right now we know it's coming quickly but if anyone is interested in coming in and taking a tour I'll be happy to show them around we have a special running until July 31st if they get signed up for an apartment before July or by July 31st then there will be a reduction in rent for the first two months of their time at Sarah Harding so if they take a one-bedroom apartment we will be reducing the rent by three hundred and sixty five dollars per month for the first two months well that's quite a savings it is a big savings and if they take a studio apartment, it will be reduced by $210 a month for the first two months. Okay, now you mentioned studio and one bedroom. What's the difference between those, Mary? Well, the one bedroom has its own bedroom. It's just like an apartment that you would move into in another type building. There's a bedroom, there's a living room. Uh, most of them have kitchen areas. They have their own private bath and shower. So... If they go with a studio, you eliminate that one bedroom and you have like your bed in your living room space. Talk a little bit about the tours. When somebody comes in to take a look <laughs> around Sarah mm -hmm. Harding, do some of the residents maybe invite them in to take a look at oh, what they yeah. have to offer? Yes, they're very proud of their apartments and they should be. They look very cozy. They look comfortable. They've got their own belongings that they enjoy having around their own furniture there are pictures of their families hanging on the wall the things that are important to them so and they like to show those things off getting busy with mary wilson of sarah harding now sarah harding is for of course the older but mm -hmm. it is not really assisted living is it no it's not we are independent living so you can have your car you can come and go as you please we just ask that people sign in and out so that we if someone's not showing up for a meal they're supposed to be there for we check to make sure that they're all right um, so it's there it is independent living there is no medical assistance there whatsoever however they can bring in their own help if they would need it for short term for instance physical therapy or have a a visiting nurse come in to make sure f following a, a rehab period where they need to have a little assistance for a short time there are different providers out there in the clinton community that will come in and we we certainly welcome them independent living but there are activities and meals are available yes there are three meals a day that are available they are a purchase uh type of setup because so many people prefer to cook on their own so we don't want to include them in the actual rent because some would take would take advantage of that opportunity or some would not so this way it's kind of fair across the board and it's up to them to decide what they want to do what kind of activities do you invite in oh that bus is getting a lot of miles on it <laughs> they're going and coming all the time uh they go over to forest inn in okay. in morrison for meals they go shopping frequently. Uh, they were going somewhere yesterday morning when I walked into the building. There were a bunch of them that are ready to load the bus. But they go to all the different, like Dollar Tree, Fairway, Walmart, Jewel. They go shopping all over. Walgreens is always on Senior Citizen Day that they go. So they're constantly coming and going. They do like to go to Circuit 21, mm -hmm. so I believe I heard there was something set up maybe for the showboat that they'll go down there. I think a bunch of them went down during the Dolly Parton thing they just had a week ago or last a week ago Saturday down at the showboat. There were a few of them that went down for that. So 
they go out as not just daytime activities. There are some evening activities that are scheduled as well. You also wanted to bring up an event that will be coming up at the airport on uh, June 25th. Yes, June 25th. I don't have all the details with me, and I apologize for that. But if someone's interested in it, they can always call me at Sarah Harding, and I can give it to them. It will be benefiting the Alzheimer's Association. It is a fly-in, drive-in breakfast, and it will be on Sunday June 25th. Okay, summer special airport. going on right now till mm -hmm. the end of July. If people want to find out more information, what's the phone number and address? Address is 308 South Bluff in Clinton. And our, our telephone number is 243-1341. Thanks so much for coming in. We'll talk You're to you welcome. in July. Okay. 745, our weather update.